Ever wondered how sonar works? <laughs> this is so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> Howdy everyone, I'm Josh. And I'm Van. We've also got with us today the Bat Computer, Penny One. Greetings. And welcome to Batman Science Lab, the show where we test the science behind Batman's crime-fighting technology. We've been learning all about his tech as members of the Night Watch, Penny One's new program where people like you and me from all around the world get to practice honing our skills to be everyday heroes. That's right, in today's show, we're gonna learn about a type of tech that Batman uses a lot in different situations. In fact, its science has been used for thousands of years by bats. Oh, hey, I think Penny One has a call coming in. Yeah. Wow, it's yeah. Reagan from Young Sheldon. Yeah. Hey guys. You're just in time. Reagan really likes science too, which is a lot different from her character on the show. What sort of science are you guys talking about today? Oh, well, we were just about to dive into the concept of echolocation. Echolocation is awesome. Hey, would you want to explain to everyone what it is? Sure. Great. Sound is vibrations that travel in waves. These waves are kind of like waves in the ocean. They ripple out through air or water or even some materials. And whenever they hit something that they can't move through, they can bounce back in a different direction. Hmm, so that's why we can hear sound underwater, but we can't really hear through a super thick block of steel? Exactly. Let's imagine that we had a very special device that could send out and absorb those waves as they bounce back and calculate just how far objects are. That's what helps bats navigate and find food in the dark. They send out sound waves, which bounce off of objects and tell the bats what's around them. And Batman uses echolocation too, right? That's right. He uses these devices called sonar, which is short for sound navigation and ranging, or radar, which is short for radio detection and ranging. This technology uses the concept of echolocation to allow the Dark Knight to navigate when it's hard to see, to locate objects from far away, or to detect incoming threats on land or sea. That seems super useful. Yeah. Hey, you know how like when you're watching a movie and uh, they're on a submarine, you hear that low beeping sound? Yeah, that's it, Penny One. So that is the sound output of a type of sonar device that is sending out signals and receiving the information of when those signals bounce back off of objects. And radar's radio electromagnetic waves work in pretty much the same way. You know, I bet you guys could experiment with your own version of sonar. Hey, that gives me an idea. All right, to demonstrate how Batman sonar or radar devices really work, you are gonna use echolocation to help the Dark Knight navigate safely through the nighttime streets of Gotham City. <laughs> wow. Yeah, you're gonna be blindfolded just like Batman is so neither of you can see. Now you're gonna have to rely solely on the sound waves of the ping pong balls to move around. Oh, so the ping pong balls are gonna be like the little beeps from the sonar device. Yeah, exactly. And when you wanna move around, you're gonna take a ping pong ball and roll it on the ground and listen for the sound it makes when it hits an object. You're literally gonna be seeing with sound. So if I want to avoid a building, I need to listen to the sound it makes and then move away from it. Yes, you got it. And you're gonna do an amazing job, I know you are. And I'm gonna be right beside you to make sure that you stay safe, okay? Now, are you ready to give echolocation a shot? Oh yeah. Batman, are you ready? <laughs> Let's get started. Right, here we go, ready, Van? Okay. Go. Oh, I heard something go. there, listen okay. Listen to the sound, listen to okay. the sound. Something in front of me. Okay, so there's another building Doing there. Great. I think I found a clear path. I found a clear path. Yep. Be careful. Okay. There's a little area where I can move. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, I did it. Let's see. Good this is a good stuff. spot. Good, good stuff. spot. Okay. Good spot. All right. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, so there's something to my right. How about to my left? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. Okay. You hear that? that sounded yep. Really loud. I heard that. That sounded pretty loud. So that must mean that it's closer. Yes. I didn't hear anything this direction. No, okay. So let's see. Oh. So that must mean it's right in front of you, right? Yeah. Something Good. over Good here. Good stuff. Good something stuff. Something over here. Okay, yeah, there's something there. Let's see. How about over to the left? Yeah, now? yeah, yeah. You're doing amazing, man. Keep okay, it going. Okay, okay. Let's see. Let's Keep see. Keep it going. Trying to play it safe. Yeah, trust the sound waves. The trust the sound waves. Oh, okay. I just threw a ball over here. Oh, let's keep see. Going. Let's see. You're Is there, there anything over to the right? Did you hear anything? No, I don't hear anything okay, over to the keep right. Keep going, keep going, keep okay, going. Okay, okay. And stop, you did it. I did it? You did it, man. <laughs> High five, way to go. You went through all of that. Okay. Wow. How'd it feel? Well, it felt really cool. You could really hear when the ping pong balls hit a building, 
you could hear exactly where that building was, and I found that to be so cool. Now, can you imagine if you were a bat flying through the cave in the dark? I mean, that's exactly how they're able to see. Yeah, and that's exactly what they need to survive. So kind of like how Batman uses his tech to see through the hard places, we use ping pong balls. It really shows that echolocation does work. Yeah. That was awesome, you guys. Great job getting through that obstacle course. Thanks, Reagan, and thanks for telling us all about echolocation. Yeah, just like bats can use sound to navigate through the dark caves, the dark night can use sonar and radar to navigate and find things in hard to see situations. I find it amazing how we can make technology based on science and nature, and Batman can use that to his advantage. Well, thanks for joining us here on Batman Science Lab. You can find more great Batman content here on the DC Kids channel. What, hey, what happened to the lights? Well, it looks like we're gonna have to use echolocation to find the light switch. <laughs> <laughs>